so me and Bo are here removing a beehive from the wall. Um, I've got a bunch of beehives, um, second hand ones, and I've got no bees to fill it up with, so I put an ad out on Facebook saying that I'll do free bee removals and swarm catches, and um, the lady who owns this place gave me a call. There's a big hive in this wall, and um, yeah, we're just gonna take all the bees, take some of their comb and their brood, and set them up in a new home. Or something like that. So, here we are. Just ripping the first panel off the wall. We'll get the bees back. There's the smoke. Unreal, man. It's huge, eh? <laughs> yeah. See all that brood and honey. We've got capped honey, brood. Look, see how they built the layers like that and they yeah. stepped it in? Yeah. And there's another one? Yeah. That is unreal. Right. There's all be bees in behind there, too. Yeah, I know. <sighs> That's cool. Unreal. Yeah. And so there should be honey in the wall then, further back in. Yeah. Cool. Right, eh? What sucks Look at them all up there. Like, yeah. All right, be back soon. Okay, now we can see what's going on. Look, beautiful capped honey, brood, more honey up the top. Look, she's laying them out solid, eh? Yeah. Pretty nice pattern there. And it's and all down here. And yeah. Across there too. Still got a lot of beehive to uncover here. What do you reckon, Bo? We keep going down a little bit more? Yeah, go down and, and then work across, eh? Yeah, we'll take out this whole section. Yeah. Right, eh? So, we're digging down deep in the hive, and look what we have found. Little baby bee emerging from her, from her, um, what's that called? Cell. From her cell. That's unreal. It is. So, yeah, here's what we're looking at. There's a stud there, but they keep going lower. Pretty big hive. Figure out what's going on in here. No, no. This, uh, this is huge. It's crazy, mate. All right. Like well, a bee vacuum. Let's have a look in here. Oh, look at that! It's a mat of bees. Nice and easy. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. We're okay, thanks, Monsieur uh, Megan. There you go. Wow. That is extraordinary. That's just Come one half. Come have a look at this, Megan. Okay, so we're getting through them. Chopping out. Lovely section to brood. Look at that. And then they go in the frames. Just get connected like that. A bit of brood, bit of drawn out comb for them. See, that's a nice solid one. There's even little baby bees hatching. But yeah, free bees. Right, so now. We're on to the next side. We've just exposed it, and if you look behind here, check it out. That's all solid honey. Unreal. Solid. It's crazy. And there's more bees and comb behind there. So, it might turn into a big day here. Okay, so I'm back for day two of this hive removal. Um, not much action here. 
few bees. Um, I got the trusty bee vac again. And um, we've got a hive set up here trying to catch some stragglers. But the real fun is over here. Look what these guys are doing. I'll uh, go for a look. See if I don't get stung. Couple of guys checking me out. So, I'm about to get the vacuum cleaner out and suck all them up. Okay, so what I've actually tried to do is put up a um, hive just in front of this cluster to try and draw them into it. And um, for bait, I'm using. Oh, I dropped it. Swarm Commander. Highly recommend this stuff. I use it on all my bait hives and it works really, really well. But anyway. Um, just show you what I'm doing here. Got the smoke. Got this cluster of bees, and if I can get them to start moving in, they should go in really, really quickly. But it's got to get them interested first. Don't want to give them too much smoke because they might fly away, but just enough to make them want to move. So um, we've really got them coming into this box here now, look at that, that is crazy. Can you, all you guys see that? Man, there must be 10,000 bees here. I don't know, I'm just guessing. The lads are here again, Bo and Will. Look at this. Straight in guys, get in there. Okay, so look at these bees loving this. We're gonna catch thousands and thousands. Oh, there's still some here. What I need to do is get them to lift and go up to there. So I'll show you how I do that. I'll grab that smoker, bro. This drip hanging on the um on the pipe again. Okay, bit of smoke. Yeah. Okay, so we've got the lads. We're uh, back in the yard now, and um, we've now split all the brood frames into three brood boxes. One's there, one's there, one's there. And then we filled these top honey supers up with bees, and these two here are going home with the lads, and that one there is staying here with me so there's still what's going on here there's, there's still a heap of bees in this box and I've got some forming a couple of little clusters here in the morning I'll take that entrance I'll open that entrance up again and a heap of bees are gonna pour out of that and at the same time I'll crack this lid and bees are just going to pour out everywhere and they'll do their thing they'll fly around and then hopefully they'll go straight back into 
into the entrance again and that will be their new home so that was a big day so I'm trying to get back in there and that it's all pretty exciting